This was the only way, because I never would have stopped reaching out for you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Deku! Huh? Why am I here? Someone's gonna teach that worthless nerd how the world really works. Huh? Gotchan? He's down below. I can hear him talk. I hate it when he talks heroes. Dude, you talk heroes all the time. That's because I'll actually be one. Deku is just a useless copycat. I wanted to be a hero. He wanted to be a hero. All Might was my favorite. He became his favorite as well. But when I got my quirk, I knew it meant I'll achieve great things in life. It's proof that I'm gonna be the best. But Deku, he thought that my success was also his. He kissed me on the cheek and said, My Kachan is amazing. His? He said I'm his. Can you believe that? Wow, dude. It really rubbed me the wrong way. So when I found out that Deku was quirkless, I thought that finally he'll stop trying to be me. I felt like I didn't have to take care of his sorry ass any longer. I teased and made fun of him, called him Deku so he'd understand there's no way in hell he'll ever catch up to me. But that dumb shit kept chasing me no matter what, I just couldn't get rid of him. Wherever I went, he kept showing up. And one day, when I accidentally fell into the river, he embarrassed me in front of everyone. I didn't need any help, I was just fine by myself. But Deku thought he was some kind of hero saving me. Me? Like I was the victim. I'm the best. I don't need saving. I had to make sure Deku understood that. I was gonna be a real hero, and no loser like him will mock me like that. Okay dude, chill, we get it. So that's what Kachan really thinks of me. Maybe he even meant the thing he said today. And take a swan dive off the roof of a building. Everyone thinks I'm useless. Even my best friend thinks I'm a failure. That there's no hope for me. What would All Might say? And now, he wants to embarrass this crappy school by applying to UA and then failing miserably. I wish I could just squish him like the little bug that he is. He's still there, down below. Maybe I should go on and do it. It's not like anyone cares. Hey, I got an idea. We should go to the arcade and keep your mind off him, you know? Fine. There's only one way to make Kachan see that I'm not a coward. I'll never be able to catch up. No matter how hard I try, the distance between us is only growing. Kachan, don't blame yourself. I'm the one to blame. Mom, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> that damn... <laughs> I'm sorry, but this is the only way. Because I never would have stopped reaching out for you. Deku! Gotcha. You do care, don't you? Deku is just a useless copycat. I had to make sure Deku understood that. I hate it when he talks heroes. He thought that my success was also his. I wish I could just squish him like the little bug that he is.
another nightmare? Was I sleepwalking? I think one for all just saved me. I might have jumped out of the balcony. What's wrong with me? Everyone's asleep. I must be quiet. I know I'm being selfish, but I can't risk being alone tonight. He's the only one who understands what I'm going through. Who the hell is knocking at this time? Uh, who in the fu- Bad dreams again. The same one. But this time... I... I actually... Shh. I'm here, Deku. It's alright, it's just a dream. I'm not so sure about that. It seemed so real. My window was broken when I woke up. I think my quirk reacted to it as if I was in danger. You are a danger to yourself, but that's not something new. But I'll always be right there for you. You know that, right? Will you? Are you doubting me? I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. Maybe I'm still dreaming. Can you feel me? Do I need to squeeze you even tighter so you know this is real? Please, do. Hold me in your arms and don't let go. It'll be hard to train like this, you know. Just for tonight. I need you. I was kidding. I'm not letting you go till morning. Even if you ask me to. Got it? Yeah. I love you, Kachan. I love you too, you stupid nerd. Come inside unless you want the others to wake up and see us like this. Yeah, I'm sorry. This must be embarrassing. Do you still think I'm embarrassed of you? You aren't? Not one bit. I was being an idiot. I can't believe you kept chasing someone like me for all of these years. I don't want to fall asleep. What? When I'm inside your arms, I feel like home. Okay, Shakespeare, it's time for you to sleep. Try not to drool all over me.